this map has good graphics, but it sucks. The trailer made it seem like it would be a great map to play on, but it just turned out to be a piece of crap map. Ha <laughs> ha, a triple knife. That's a smooth move. I don't know why, but today I just have a desire to play with the F2000. I want to kill some noobs with the F2000. And I don't know why. Maybe it's because of Halo Reach coming out. Is anyone still playing this game? I'm trying to be open to Halo Reach, but I know that I would only play the game for two months maximum. And that's a, a reason why, to me, there's no point in getting it, because as soon as Black Ops comes out, I'll never touch Halo Reach again. So by being open, because I'm probably not going to get the game, I, I, I really don't see any reason for me to get it and play it. But I'm trying to be open. I'm watching other people's videos, watching other people play it. And I just don't see anything that interests me. And in my opinion, it seems like the Call of Duty players that got Halo Reach and are playing it, it seems like they don't really like it. It's almost as if they're pretending to like it. I don't know. I'm not really much of a first person shooter kind of guy. I don't really have a great history. Oh, I didn't expect a guy to be there. <laughs> I don't really have a great video game background history with first person shooters. On the next gen console, Modern Warfare 2 is definitely my first first person shooter that I played online. And that I really actually played a lot. But I can't say all time because I remember as a kid growing up with the N64 playing split screen, GoldenEye, hiding in, in, in those invisible walls. Does anybody remember that game where you would go and I forgot what map it was, but you would just you would be able to hide in these invisible walls and pathways. And <laughs> it's just the Call of Duty series that I like. There's just so many ways to kill somebody. And even the ways that are annoying, like Commando, and the Grenade Launcher, the RPG, and camping, and all the equipment, Claymores, and C4s, and grenades, and... It seems that people are always complaining about something with the game. But what's, what's funny, though, is that I you never really hear people saying this, or talking about this, but... At the end of each game... There's only, in Modern Warfare 2, 95% of the time at the end of each game, there's only, there's only, let's say, two to three players that actually had a great game combined on both teams. And everyone else either got owned or they had a, ah, a bad game or it was kind of decent. And I would think that you would want to have more great games than those mediocre or bad games it's so funny because people will complain about camping they'll say stuff like oh that was a great game but you camped <laughs> so it's like because you were camping it's no longer it was no longer a good game camping just eliminates it from being a good game <laughs> Still, to this day, I don't understand why it's such a taboo, a taboo, to camp. I don't understand that because I always think of this game as getting into the best position. And when you're in the best position, you're not supposed to go anywhere because you're in the best position. Why would you leave the best position to go somewhere else when somewhere else is not the best position? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just using this F2000 like an M16. I'm just doing trigger taps. One trigger tap, two trigger tap. And look at that. I'm at the bottom of the scoreboard. 
<laughs> this F2000 has me at the bottom of the scoreboard. When it comes to camping, people come back for all kinds of reasons. People come back for revenge. But most people come back because they're trying to get you out of the best position because you're in the best position and they want to take that position over so that they can be in the best position. That's what I do when I'm not in the best position. I compromise. I try to find a spot where I can counter snipe them or counter M16 them, take them out and then go and take their spot over. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. I just I never understood that when you think about it that way when you think about camping as you know getting the best position and when you're in the best position really why would you leave that position that does, I don't I don't know maybe someone will be able to tell me in the comments <laughs> I'll probably get flamed in the comments it's time for me to be MVP I'm doing everything this game Look at that, I'm taking out chopper gunners. I got some flags, I defended the flags, I'm still defending the flags. I'm doing everything this game. And I'm at the bottom of the scoreboard. And I have the M16 again. <laughs> People are probably getting mad. They're probably tired of seeing me use the M16. But I just, it's my favorite gun right now. It's. It, I don't really feel like using any other guns. I just, for some reason today, I wanted to use the F2000. But I really don't. I don't have a desire to use any other guns than the, the one trigger tap kill machine. Look at that one trigger tap headshot. Have you ever been new to? Have you ever? Let me switch back to this F2000. I know why I'm using this because I want to level up as quickly as I can. Because I'm trying to get to that ninth prestige so that I can get to that 10th prestige before Black Ops. And I don't know if I'm going to make it. It's not looking too good. Oh, that was a nice little kill there with the F2000. I was looking like a pro with that kill. Didn't, didn't have any trouble killing right there. And I'm still at the bottom of the scoreboard. 7-11 or 11-7, I think. Who knows? All right. Come on. Come out. Oh, there you go. Oh, that's a nice kill with the F2000. And look at that. I unlocked the grenade launcher. I'm going to be tubing next game. Oh, look at this little sequence right here. That could be on a montage, uh, an M16 rampage. Did you see that? Just, just killing those noobs. I actually got a... A private message from a subscriber. They were telling me that the F2000 has a glitch. When you get when you unlock the shotgun, the shotgun has unlimited range. So it's like a super noob tube. <laughs> and it has a lot more in the tank than the noob tube does. So I don't know if that's true, but hey, I'm gonna find out because I'm gonna be tubing next game. <laughs> with my grenade launcher unlocked and then I'm gonna try out the shotgun and see what it does why not abuse the game at the end of the game's life right everyone's been abusing things such as the care package glitch do you remember the care package glitch when guys were getting care packages and and running around with it and they were going super fast <laughs> I remember when I the first time I ever did that I, I, I didn't do that to actually get kills. I was doing it to get to the other side of the map and then throw my care package. Like, let's say on Favilla, let's say I got my care package on C. I would switch to my care package and then run down that, that little right pathway all the way to A and throw my care package on that street. So that's what I would used to do. I never really thought about killing people, knifing people with it. You know, but of course there were people trying to abuse the game. And there goes a splash. About time I get a splash in this AC-130. Taking out the Harrier, being a good teammate. I'm the MVP, I'm doing everything. Taking out air support with the Stinger and with the AC. Putting up air support, getting flags, defending flags, using the F-2000. Man, what a beast game right here. It's coming to an end. 
Oh, a care package. Why not steal this care package at the end here? A counter UAV as time expires. All right, not bad. Hey, look at that. I was at the bottom of the scoreboard and I finished the game at the top of the scoreboard. That's a smooth move. What is this? From prone to last stand, man. That is the definition of a noob, going from prone to last stand. Last stand is a waste, man. Oh, I got the E-drop. E-drop coming on A. E-drop, I make my teammates better. Look at that, I make my teammates better, getting that E-drop.